So what he wanted was transparency for people to see the full workout, to see the full Colin Kaepernick. Again, you, you mentioned obviously Max is going to get in here. And like I said, I'm in the streets. Max almost seems blacker than you, Stephen A. <laughs> with 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 what time he with with he's time coming, out. you time know, with this commentary. Time, 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 with all due respect, my brother. You <laughs> I'm just you, saying, dog. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. I'm just I'm a, saying. I'm gonna check you right now. You don't cross. I'm the line. just saying. Time, time, time. Wait a minute. You don't cross the line. <laughs> First of all, like I said, you, Colin Kaepernick, <laughs> Eric Reed, any of y'all that want to debate me in front of black people and talk about what's best for black people, name the time and place, I'll show up. I don't want to hear, what's the definition of blackness? Is there a definitive definition of blackness? Why are you giving the impression that because I don't march lockstep with every single thing that Colin Kaepernick wants. Okay, excuse me. Hold on. Wait, wait a minute. I'm not agreeing with everything T T T that Colin T Kaepernick has I, done. I, I'm not saying that, but you said, but okay. you just sat up there and used an expression. More blacker. Excuse me. I'm from Hollis, Queens, New York City. More black. You ain't the you ain't the only you ain't the only brother out there that's in the streets. I'm in the streets well, every day. I get it. And I'm a, a matter of, so let's be very clear. And you damn well know that's the truth. And so my point to you is this. Again, I'm not going to disrespect you. I'm not going to go that route. But based on just what you just said, this is supposedly Stephen A. and T.O. going at one another. Did you know that I invited Colin Kaepernick to give him this platform for the entire two hours? I said, you can edit the damn show. You can have it live. We can talk wherever you want to talk. The floor is yours. I also gave that invitation to Eric Reed. I know people at other networks that has given Colin Kaepernick that same thing. They disagreed with him to some degree. Are you questioning their blackness, too? Come on, man. That, no, there's certain things that's like crossing said, the line. Dude, that's, that, I mean, you're taking it as disrespect. There's no disrespect. There's no disrespect just, to that? No, not a dude. It's tongue in cheek, but at the same time, like I said, like I said, I'm in the streets. Like I said, I hear and what's going on. And as I said, like I said, you don't have to agree. I don't totally agree with some of the things. As I, as I, te as I texted you the other day, he could have articulated to or, or expressed his thoughts better than he did in the interview. Or if he didn't want to do that, he could have had his representative speak on his behalf. Yeah, you probably offered that, that platform for him Tara. to come on and, and speak on whatever, but he hasn't done that. That's not... That's not for me or, or you to say why he did or he didn't. The Hall of Famer Terrell Owens was with us earlier. We had a spirited debate about Colin Kaepernick and how he chose to handle the workout that the NFL had set up for him. Stephen A., I want to give you a final word here before we close out. Well, first things first, um, T.O. obviously offended me very, very much by questioning my blackness the way that he did. I thought it was Bush League. I think it's BS. Um, but... I forgive him. He's my brother, and I got love for him. And, you know, it is what it is. There's a lot of black people out there in America at this particular moment in time that have a problem with the position that I take. That's fine. I want to assure everybody in the black community I'm not backing up one damn bit. I'm not changing my mind. I'm not bowing down to y'all vitriol and the venom that you are aiming in my direction. Keep it coming. I don't give a damn because I know I am right on this. This is not about whether Colin Kaepernick should have worked out or not. My issue with Colin Kaepernick is that his actions were not consistent with what his camp had spent two months telling me and others he wanted. That is my issue. And it's also very, very important to me that everybody understands that when you are a black person, you are operating behind the eight ball. You don't, I am not going to allow the message to be disseminated to young black men and women, boys and girls out there to believe for one second that you think you can do what you want to do, how you want to do it, when you want to do it, without listening to anybody, but you got your hand out for somebody else's product or money. It does not work that way. That's not re reality. And on this show, I'm going to continue to support brothers and sisters who do the right thing and call out those who don't. And if you don't like it, it's tough because I will not change. This is this issue is not going anywhere. Thanks for watching ESPN on YouTube. For more sports highlights and analysis, be sure to download the ESPN app. And for live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+.